For years, Taiwan has wanted to purchase modern, foreign-built submarines, but has found it impossible due to pressure from Beijing. Taiwan also lacks the key technology to build its own submarines. But defense officials confirm that progress is underway on a plan to build submarines in Taiwan using technology purchased from U.S. defense contractors. Officials told lawmakers that they already have all the licenses needed to obtain the U.S.-made submarine parts. A blueprint of the model is due next spring, and the first submarine could be ready by 2025. At long last, the indigenous submarine program is taking off. Naval officers told lawmakers that Taiwan already has key licenses for all the requisite U.S.-made submarine parts. These critical parts include the submarine combat system, torpedo launchers, diesel engines, and sail-mounted sonar systems. In April of this year, the U.S. granted approval to U.S. defense contractors willing to sell the components to Taiwan. Shipbuilding firm CSBC Corporation is expected to deliver a blueprint for a prototype next March 1st. Some 49.3 billion NT will be spent starting next year, with the goal of completing the sub by 2025. The first sub will cost 49.3 billion NT. If we cannot complete it by 2025, it's possible we won't be able to get more funding. 7.5 billion NT will be spent over the course of 2019. Half of that will come from the Navy's budget and go toward helping CSBC Corporation build a submarine shipyard. Today, lawmakers hit officials with tough questions about how the shipbuilding firm won the government contract without having its own shipyard and on who would own the completed infrastructure. As the project can't start without lawmakers' approval, government officials are scrambling to settle the qualms in order to meet the timeline.